Good morning, family. Welcome to today's Lessons for Life. Today is Friday, October 23rd, 2009. It's a reading in 2 Chronicles chapter 22. And as always, I encourage you to read the chapter for yourself. See what you get from it. This is a short chapter. Uh, see what you get from it. Email us. We'll put it on the blog. Uh, but we're actually continuing even with these chapters, kind of continuing the same lesson that I um, brought up a couple of days ago and continue through. Uh, basically, of uh, watching who you um, keep company with and uh, are around and uh, we see here an example of the king ah Ahaziah and um, from how I read it it's kind of like he's just at the wrong place uh, at the wrong time of course as you, as you read it you see that he was doing evil right evil as well because of his mother uh, who we remember yesterday and yesterday's lesson as well too but now his mother is counseling him to do evil but uh, there was a man by the name of Jehu actually was cutting off all of uh, Ahab's line and because Ahaziah now had went over to where Ahab was then he actually ends up and like I say he was kind of caught in the wrong place at the wrong time so once again the lesson goes forth that you, know, you really need to be careful of who you keep company with who you uh, are around even if they're doing um, something wrong and you think that you're safe because you're not doing the same thing that's wrong you can get caught up and get the same punishment as they would just because you're around them and I've seen this happen especially in the business that we are in uh, so many times where someone gets they're in the wrong place or they're, they're, they're somewhere and they might not be doing you know anything wrong they might just be in the presence of people who are doing something wrong but they end up um, suffering and even losing their lives because of uh, their association with people so even though you may think you're doing the right thing just by your association with someone else as we see in the story in this chapter here um, you can lose it all so you really need to be mindful of who you're around um, and what they're doing and uh, make sure that you stay away from things that aren't done right because you can suffer the same punishment or uh, uh, you can just suffer period just because of your association with them so that's an important lesson like I said we've kind of been going through different levels of it from yesterday with the um, you know who you marry your wife husband whatever but even just being around someone and um, getting that punishment which you know may seem unfair but you have the you have to use right judgment really in choosing the right people that you're around and be conscious of your environment be conscious of you know what the other people around you may be doing so with that create yourself a wonderfully blessed day today and we'll talk again tomorrow